So how do you get more consistency from your team when it comes to customer service? I'm gonna tell you in this video. Hi, my name is Hank Ebeling and I help small business owners crush the competition by delivering outstanding customer service and outstanding customer experience. And in this video, we're talking all about how do you get that consistency with your team so they can deliver on the type of customer service that you want as a owner? Well, there's two things that have to take place here. And one is going to be you need accountability. This is so often where small business owners fail, right? They don't keep the accountability there in terms of keeping their team, uh, you know, keeping their feet to the fire when it comes to the service standards. If you watch my content, hopefully you have service standards. But if you don't, you need to establish those and then keep them accountable to it. Because at the end of the day, if people don't have accountability, why are they going to continue to do behavior that you've asked them of? So you have to have that accountability. And this could be where you discuss the service standards and the expectations you have in one-on-one -on -one meetings, in group meetings, in email. And then when people aren't displaying the behaviors that you want, that you let them know, you confront them on this because you don't want them to get going and build momentum of going in the opposite direction, right? Of the behaviors that you don't want. So you have to hold people accountable at all levels. If you have a manager, you know, general manager, district manager, area manager, whatever, they have to do the same thing. And then you have to hold them accountable as well. The other thing is you have to reward when you see the behaviors that you want. So it's not just about the hey, knock it off, that's the bad behavior, but you have to really reward people when you see the behavior that you want. And this could be letting them know, hey, Michael, what you did with that customer the other day, that was amazing, and that's what we want to see. Let them know that. Share those instances with everybody on the team via email or at group meetings because then that makes everyone else want to level up. They want to be the ones getting talked about. They see, well, everyone else is doing all of these customer service centric type things. I need to be doing them. So that's really important. You could also do things such as like customer service superstar of the month, customer service superhero of the month, kind of like an employee of the month, but very focused on customer service. You could do something like a wow card where every time you and your team see moments, wow moments that your team has done or just great service moments, you could give them a card and maybe at the end of the month, whoever has the most cards gets XYZ gift or something along those lines. But those are the two types of things you must have. You got to have accountability and you got to be rewarding the behavior. So remember, I'm a small business owner helping you, the fellow small business owner. If you loved this video, please like it and it'd be great for you to subscribe because I'm always leaving videos to help you and your business. And you know what? Customer service it's kind of a bad rap, right? That it's soft, but it's not. It's actually a very intelligent business strategy.